Hello everyone. Uh, I'm going to start making my first Minecraft mod reviews and other videos now. Uh, for my first one, for my first mod review, I'm going to be doing a mod called Marco Polo's Better or Dis Distribution. I don't know why I cannot say that distribution very well. Uh, I was saying it earlier today. Pretty fine compared to now, anyway. Um, yeah. So, uh, first thing, to show what this mod is, pretty much, or to say what this mod is, is it pretty much takes all your ores, all the vanilla Minecraft ores, and makes it more like real life, how they would uh, be in real life. Or how they would spawn in real life. They don't really spawn in real life, but anyway. So, to show you this, I'm going to go in my gold mine. Um, my villagers here, hard at work, as you can see. They're all up here for some odd reason. Actually, there are some down there. Um, so yeah, this is a gold ore vein, uh, it, they do spawn at certain levels, like they wouldn't regular Minecraft, but the lever, levels they, they do spawn at are altered, as you can see right now, I'm at level, ooh, I'm lagging horribly, I'm at level, uh, 49 it looks like, and regularly, I think gold ore would spawn somewhere between... I don't know, uh, probably somewhere in the low 20s, level 20 and below, um, but instead it's spawning up here at 49, and what this mod does, uh, this is my little redstone torch for this little contraption, what this mod does is it takes it all and it makes it all spawn in like this huge, in, by, by a, trunk, a chunk scale pretty much, it'll just spawn these huge veins, and in, the, in all these huge veins they'll have little tinier veins, of the actual ore, which will, well, actually be ore that you can smelt and stuff. Other than that, it'll just be stone. And I'll show you a second here. That damn villager got in the way. Let's go over here. Um, that they don't spawn very commonly. I've searched through several several cave cave systems, and that's the only ore vein I could find. Uh in this area that I built my house in. Um, so, you can change how the ores spawn, like how big the little vein sizes are, whether it be four blocks or five blocks of ores, or, and how big the actual vein, the huge vein is. Um, I might be confusing you guys by saying that. Um, anyway, uh, if I am, I don't mean to, really, I don't. <laughs> kind of, anyway, so I found another ore vein over here one a little bit ago, not too long ago, sometime last night, for sure. Anyway, what, and this one here I think is an iron vein, yes it is, you can see it by the sign, and me killing myself by jumping from too high, and what it does is it spawns iron, iron ore in this huge vein, it goes from here to there, there's even a little bit right here and there. It's not too horribly overpowered because I don't have any more torches on me. Because it, it'll, uh, well, this is pretty common. It's got a pretty decent orb uh, vein size with this. I think that's a lot of lava. Anyway, um, so yeah, this is pretty much a, uh, mo the uh, mod. You can, however, however you can configure it so that way it'll spawn huge orb sizes of diamond every time if you want to do that. Well, that just horribly ruins Minecraft, so I pretty much leave it how he has it set. I'll show you a horribly overpowered version of it in a second. Uh, so see you in a second. Okay, so now what I've done is I've completely changed in the configuration how exactly the ores spawn, or one ore actually is diamond. And I've made it completely overpowered by making it spawn huge amounts of diamond ore. This is all one vein, huge vein of diamond that I've kind of hollowed out. Um, yeah, you can make it horribly overpowered if you do this, but it's a fast way of getting diamond if you wanted that much diamond. Um, 
overall, I do like this mod, as long as you don't horribly overpower it. Um, it looks like the texture is kind of broken. My diamond is missing it, missing it, this uh, pixel. Anyway, so, that's the mod. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this mod, uh, mod review. Um, hope I didn't stutter way too much, and hope you guys actually understand me. I will leave a link to his forum where you can find the mod and everything about it. And I will leave the, a link to the texture pack where you can find it and everything in the description. Well, see y'all later.